Hello everyone, welcome back to the third installment of Fix Your Profiles. In this series, you guys send me your return of profiles on Twitter, and I take a look at your top scores, score trends, and habits to then give you suggestions on how to become as well-rounded of a player as possible. Let's start with our first player. In recent weeks, you seem to have a decent amount of scores in the 80s range, so I would try to avoid those as much as possible and focus on scores in the mid to upper 90s range. If you do find yourself in that lower range and are struggling quite a bit, don't be afraid to quit out and try a new file instead of overstraining. Your stream scores seem to fall behind a bit on the accuracy side as well. This is due to hitting very early, which results in your mean being higher than negative 10 milliseconds. Learning to hit later and focus less on falling behind will allow you to hit the patterns much more fluently and in turn will better your accuracy. This applies to your other AA goal scores, but is most evident in your stream scores. You can also try playing files on a lower rate to familiarize yourself with the patterns more, which can help as well. Lastly, your technical score catalog is a bit scarce, so I would try and engage yourself with some of the latest and older technical packs as well. With that said, here are your pack suggestions. Your CBs are very good in your upper end scores, but your accuracy is holding back some percentage. Your scores can also be a bit unbalanced, meaning that you seem to be hitting decently late at times, but other times are hitting quite early. The best thing I could suggest is to get used to the timing windows in general by playing much easier files as you don't have any AAAs on your profile at the moment. Slowly working your way up back to your normal difficulty area, you should see a relative increase in your accuracy as a result, but it will require some patience to get there. For what judge you should train accuracy on, I would stick with the judge you are using now to gauge improvement with. As for packs, you're playing a lot of Jumpstream and are not exploring too much else, so with that, I would suggest checking out my pack tutorial in the description to give you an idea of what you should play regarding other skill sets. The ratios in your scores are pretty solid overall, and your MA scores are good as well. There are two skill sets I did notice that you don't seem to be playing much in recent months, which are Technical and Handstream. Your PA holds up okay on stream files, but your MA doesn't quite complement it, so I would try working half a rate or a whole rate lower to get the patterns down more fluently. Other than that, that's pretty much it. Here are your pack suggestions. Your ratios are so consistent on Judge 4 that I think transitioning to Judge 5 would be a great choice for you to further your improvement, as it will teach you better MA and PA control and will translate to your scores much better over time. I would also try to increase your number of AAAs to refine your accuracy a bit more. Lastly, technical and handstream don't seem to be quite apparent in your recent scores, so dabbling in those a little bit would round everything up quite nicely. With that said, here are your pack suggestions. A lot of your scores are under 90% and can even dip into the 70s at times. This consistent pattern of scores can put you at risk for injuries from overstraining. This is where I'll mention the 96% principle again, as this should be your main focus for scores and then you can test your progress out for AA goal scores. Getting scores in the 90-92 to 92 range are not bad by any means, as those will generally happen from time to time, but anything in the 80s will not be very beneficial in the long run. A big chunk of your recent scores come from Jumpstream files, so I will again mention checking out my pack tutorial for different skill set packs, or by downloading the bundle packs in game that correlate to your skill level. The majority of your recent scores are very pad stream oriented, so you seem to have a good idea of what anchory, mini jack oriented streams feel like, and are just getting back into jump stream now. Aside from your AAAs, your AA scores seem to fall behind a bit in both MA and PA once you get a little out of your comfort zone. I would try going down half a rate or a full rate and focus on scoring well on those, which will translate well later once you come back. Some MA training should help shape up your MA, while your lower rate training should help your PA. I also noticed that you've dabbled in packs such as ODI3, but haven't quite indulged in technical files too much yet, so familiarizing yourself with more technical files should increase your fundamentals a bit more. Lastly, almost all of your AAAs have been on pad stream files, as some of your jump stream scores are just shy of a AAA. Shooting for some AAAs throughout various skill sets will increase your catalog of accuracy scores quite nicely as a result. With that said, here are your pack suggestions. There's not a whole lot I can necessarily evaluate here due to your profile having a limited amount of scores and the majority of your scores being from pad oriented packs. With this noted, I would definitely check out my tutorial for the game and packs to help get you started and to give you the tools to begin your journey with this game, as that alone will help greatly. Your core track and stamina scores show that you are a very strong player physically, but your stream and technical scores are not as apparent on your profile. Since you have the physical base to train these skill sets, your transition to these skill sets should be relatively smooth as long as you are training them and approaching them properly. Lastly, you have a decent amount of scores that are relatively close to a AAA, 
so inching closer and closer to those should help your enemy more in the long run. Here are your pack suggestions. The majority of your scores are from 2018, so it's a bit hard for me to tell what you have been playing recently, but looking at your top scores from each skill set, you're pretty well rounded overall and your ratios and MA scores are pretty good too. Technical seems to be the only one that is falling behind, and even then it's not by much. I'm not quite sure if your inactivity from 4Key has transitioned to Osu Mania, but if it hasn't and you are just starting to play again, I would highly suggest being careful coming back to the game, and be very cautious with easing your way back to your previous skill level. With that said, here are your pack suggestions. A lot of your recent scores are below 85%, which is not a healthy approach to consistently playing this game. As I noted before, try going for scores in the 96 and up range to familiarize yourself more efficiently with certain patterns, accuracy, and more. Some of your highest percentage scores on your profile are great examples of what I'm referring to, but try to make this more common in your sessions. You have a pretty wide range of packs, so I do not have any pack suggestions for you, as I think changing your approach alone to this game will help immensely over time. Technical scores seem to be very scarce on a lot of people's profiles, as the majority of you are either playing Jumpstream or Stream Files for the most part. I know I sound like a broken record at this point, but I cannot stress the 96% principle enough and try avoiding scores under 90% as much as possible, as this can cause very bad habits or overstraining if done often enough. Lastly, accuracy needs a bit of work too, as some of you are very close to nabbing your first AAAs, but just need a bit more patience and practice to do so. Thank you all for watching. For the players mentioned in this video, feel free to DM me with any questions and I'd love to follow up with you. Thank you to all my patrons for supporting the channel and feel free to check out my Patreon along with my other links below. I'll see you all in whatever video I upload next and take care.